They're calling it communism. Seniors at an Albuquerque school want their prom to have a communism theme. News 13's Lizay Mitri spoke with students and school officials about the idea that many say is offensive. She's live at the Albuquerque Aquarium. Dean, this is where these high schoolers are planning to have their prom next month at the aquarium. But most seniors wanted something much more unique than an under the sea theme. The music, the lights, the decorations, they're all important ingredients when it comes to cooking up the perfect prom. Seniors at Cottonwood Classical Preparatory School near I-25 in Paseo voted online this week for the theme of their prom this year. They wanted promunism, so that's what got voted for the most. That's right, promunism, a communism-themed prom. We have a lot of jokesters in our grade, so they kind of wanted it to be funny, and a lot of them are really intense with like politics and whatnot, so um, they just came up with communism for some reason. But communism can conjure up images like this. Not a joking matter, say students who ask to be anonymous. I would hope Cottonwood would realize the seriousness of having a very powerful and destructive idea as the theme for a prom, one student wrote. Another says, while the seniors meant no harm in their choice of theme, it is not appropriate. Our students are, are in an international baccalaureate program, so they are very academically focused, and so one of the classes that they enjoy the most is a world history class. The executive director says despite the vote, this is not a done deal. He says he plans to talk with the students about it next week. We want to make sure that we honor the students' voices, but at the same time use it as a learning experience for them. At this point, he and many students aren't even quite sure what communism is supposed to look like. I honestly don't think it's that funny. I don't think it's something that um, they should be choosing as a theme for a dance. I don't understand that. The prom is supposed to be here on April 25th. While the executive director stopped short of saying he would prohibit communism, he does say he wants the students to understand that the idea of communism can generate negative reactions. Back to you. Okay, Lizzie, thank you. Well, students tell us that exchange students at Cottonwood, some of them are even from communist countries.